Okie doke. Yeah, I'm just making uh, some supper or whatever. Um, I was starting to babble uh, to myself about... Um, I was just thinking about maybe actually doing a video ahead of time, or I mean later on, about... Um, well, I was chatting with another YouTube person uh, earlier on, and uh, we were just talking about stuff about um, game design, game component design, that type of stuff. And I was just reminding myself and, and the person, too, that um, my motto lately has been, and quite for for quite some time anyways, just I, I guess it finally crystallized this week, like it I actually articulated it. And it's fight the battle, not the game. I'm sick and tired of uh, settling or saying or just giving a pass to game publishers. I'm not naming any of them and I'm not going to say that. And each one have their own um, things they have to deal with. Uh, I mean, some I would assume um, have much more con are constrained or just don't have um, as much flexibility and like, they're stuck with a certain printer or, you know, just based on what's going on or so on and so forth. Um, but I will say one thing. I'm getting tired. I'm sick and tired of going, well, that's just the way it is or, you know, so on and so forth. No, I've had enough, man. Um, so when I start doing my type of stuff, and I'm always thinking about things, I'm just always going, you know what? I want to focus on the game playing the game i want to be focused on that bit i don't want to be talking about oh the counters are smaller than the hexes or uh the counters are hard to pick up or they're too slippery or the glare of this or there's no gutter in um the rule book or i can't find uh, a certain rule or this rule is contradictory to that one or um the rules uh, have been adapted from another time period, but they've been there's so many uh, special considerations or special rules added on. You might as why didn't the publisher just make the uh, like actually do a concerted effort? Like stop being lazy is what I'm trying to say, and stop just assume. I, I just I've had enough, um, and that's the way I guess I'm focusing my my way of looking at stuff um, when I go about doing things and. Um, yeah, and you know what? Uh, I even said to the other person that I was talking to um, on Skype, I was like, I did it for the money, obviously. Um, and that's never going to be my aim or whatever. Money comes up. That's just the way it is. Um, but uh, what I'm trying to say, and I'm convinced, if I stick to this philosophy and stick to being honest and being humble and um having fun charles uh is to um that i will when i drop dead uh leave the gaming community or whatever the heck you want to call it in a bet in better shape and if it's like micro ultra micro uh incrementally better but it will have been left better than um if i had not done anything at all or in whatever that's the way i'm i'm approaching it um, um that's it uh like i said in just a tiny tiny bit i don't care all i know is that i will have left it uh in a better place uh than when it was I'll, in other words i'm contributing positively is what i think i can do and that's what i'm going to try to do um and like i said if i continue sticking with that philosophy or that outlook i think i'll be all right um uh, you know, and don't get arrogant and don't get whatever or think I'm, you know, I know what I'm like uh, or whatever or more. Uh, I'm just saying, just stick to that. And I think I, you know, things are, should be fine. Um, yeah, it's been, it's been fun. Uh, it's been an interesting week that way, I guess. I don't know what's going on with me and anxiety. Um, all I can say is this. It's been so, um, maybe... Um, I don't know. Uh, it's so it's been such a drop without the manic uh, that I'm almost per, well. I'm perplexed for sure. Uh, I'm not saying I miss it. It's weird. <laughs> I kind of do. It's bizarre. And I'm like Chris. If you think it's gone, you're out of your flipping tree. Oh, by the way, my my Bereyevich mustache is kind of coming through. I guess. Good God, we'll see what happens. 
right now I feel like I should be locked <laughs> up. I won't talk about it. But that's it. Um, yeah. Um, what am I going to do this week or what? Hold on. Hold on. I better pour it past it. Um, what am I going to do this week? Well, I worked. I uh, did a little bit for, because uh, John Longshore mentioned, um, uh, is there any naval component to Der Weltkrieg and whatnot? So I started looking into that this week. And I'll, I'll mention that next week on the live stream. It's not a lot, but uh, it'll be nice to talk about. Also, I've been uh, taking a look at the uh, Der Weltkrieg version of uh, the first, well, the first Battle of the Asanzos in it. Oh, so I wanted to take a look at that um, and see if it's... Um, with just a little bit minor tweaking, is it worthwhile uh, to actually play and uh, chit-chat about? That would be interesting to see. What else? I also looked at, uh, because Dirk was mentioning um, about the Tannenberg decision game, then he went off to Musargon, and um, I, I had, I think I had already mentioned it be uh, previously, that uh, I was toying with doing the Tannenberg game again, because I like it. And uh, from decision games, but I've got other stuff on my, like it's it's popped into the queue. That's the other thing. I'm starting to learn pacing in a weird way. It'll probably go away in a day or two. So <laughs> I'll be like, what the hell is going on with my life? Um, so, so I started looking into that and seeing why I enjoy Tannenberg. Um, and uh, about the, uh, you know, the, how different it is from the World War II version of the fire. But that's where it comes from, the fire movement system. So I started comparing that to the other World War I games. And I have started noticing some differences. So that's cool. I'd like to talk about that, hopefully maybe on uh, the next live stream. That's really about it. I better pop this on. Um, I'll see if the video sucks or not. Uh, it hasn't stopped me before, has it? So that's about it. Yeah, it was just the main thing. I'm just enjoying this uh, feel of whatever. So I'm going to try to keep keep at it that way. Um, yeah. All right, I'm off. I better go and do my little funky stuff. Okay, see ya.